in this section i will explain the concept of the implied cost of carry so the implied cost of carry is defined as the various types of costs that are associated with carrying value of an investment so there can there can be different types of financial costs which you have to uh, pay in the form of the various interest rates uh, suppose if you have borrowed some money in order to make an investment then the interest rate that you are going to pay for that it will be accounted for as the cost of carry and then there could be if a physical asset is being uh, purchased or is be like the investment is being made on a, on a physical asset like wheat or gold or silver or any such thing then we will have to account for the storage cost also and that will also be included in the implied cost of carry so implied uh, cost of carry is is can be calculated by using this very simple formula where we subtract the forward price from the we uh, subtract the spot price from the forward price to find out the value of the implicit implied cost of carry and if we know that we are going to pay some interest rates and then at the top of it we are going to pay the store storage cost also then the forward price can be uh, will be equivalent to the spot price multiplied by 1 plus r plus s where r is the risk free interest rate s is the storage cost this little s and this capital s is the spot price so uh, by using this particular formula and solving it for little s we can find out the implied cost of storage also and that would be simply the difference between the forward price minus the spot price divided by the spot price minus the risk free interest rate so we, we use this formula to find out the storage cost so i'm going to explain this concept using an example suppose we are going to invest in uh, gold and the spot price of gold given in the market is $300 per ounce and we are intending to make an investment for one year so the forward price is $330 for that for one ounce and again we also found out the risk free interest rate which turned out to be we, we are assuming it to be 8% so by using this inf information we can find out firstly the implied cost of carry and that is simply the difference between the forward price and the spot price so it would be the value of 330 dollar minus 300 dollars and this will give you a 30 dollar per ounce uh, a year implied cost of carry and then uh, if we want to find out the implied storage cost it uh, for that matter we need to plug the values the given data into this formula for storage cost and that would be simply that has been turned up turned out to be 0 0.02 or 0 0.02 and in percentage form we can say that the storage cost which we will have to incur to uh, invest um, in gold uh, whose uh, spot price is 300 dollars per ounce and the forward price is 330 dollars per ounce the storage cost in this case would be 2% a year.